Yesterday we had some dunes, so I thought I had acted, but today I learned how to um, ride dunes very quickly. It took me about 70, 70 kilometers, but after 70 kilometers I got my rhythm and I learned not to jump over dunes. I had a few close calls, but it's great, I can ride dunes now. Hi, it was a very good day. A lot of dunes, fast tracks, uh, good road books, everything was perfect. Nice uh, navigation and the dunes are uh, nice and you can jump on it and find the tracks. It was beautiful. about 220 30 kilometer liaison out uh, spent some time in the dunes that took a bit of getting used to um, so the first 40 50 kilometers had to really adjust to the riding style in the sand there thereafter it started coming together nicely um, I must say I found the navigation in the dunes a bit easier so overall good day but we were flat taps on the way back just to try and make the last special now got to admit really glad we made it Uh, we, uh, in the beginning we had problems because uh, with the brakes, so we only had rear brake. Suddenly there was Johan one on his ass because he, he went back, he was looking for something. Then we, we have been in front of us of him and then he catch, caught us again and then he jumped in a, I don't know, in a, in a hole. <laughs> he jumped in a hole and couldn't come out so fast so he turned around and bye bye and never see him again. <laughs> The morning was great. It was uh, awesome tracks this morning and uh, a lot of fun. It was like a 200 kilometer motocross track. <laughs> Ik denk dat ze alles gebogen die kalorie van ons. Dat is een bij lekker risico. Als we de hele man elke jaar komen. The Northern Cape has been an absolutely amazing experience. We have been so welcomed by the communities, local communities, the school kids coming out, taking, you know, being allowed sort of a day of school or half a day of school to come watch the racing. The local community being exceptionally uh, welcoming and um, their friendliness and, and how they received the competitors. You know, not just international competitors, but South African competitors as well. The Northern Cape has been exceptional, you can see that. And we went to different areas, you know, from, from Askam to Tainmir, uh, Yerong that, and every single place. There's, there hasn't been an issue, you know, you didn't have issues of, of petty theft or... They were just, it was incredible to have that experience, even in South African. I've never been to some of these areas and it was a, it was a very, very, very um, uh, welcoming experience from, from uh, the people in the Northern Cape area. And a, and a venue that just made sense for us in rally and especially like with the, with the bloodhound that runs there it's, it's an international event um, we're hoping to try and tie in the Kalari next year at a similar time so it sort of keeps the, the, the atmosphere going couldn't have uh, taken place without uh, this event in the Northern Cape area without the assistance on the Northern Cape tourism 
and, and that has been a huge factor of us growing there and we hope to, to take even further, um, more stages into the Northern Cape area, specifically, you know, Clay uh, Mead, Van Sales, um, again, Yen and Flay, and maybe even further up. Um, but yes, uh, Northern Cape tourism has been, has been instrumental in this, uh, us moving out at ACE uh, particular stages into that area.